Hey guys, this is just a quick update um, on something um, I've just found out about um, from the XDA website. Um, one of the users has put up a beta or a, sort of a developer build of the latest um, UI uh, for the music app, <coughs> which will apparently, according to the people over at XDA, will be in. Uh, the honeycomb build of Android. Um, the first thing you'll probably notice is the icons a bit different. Uh, it does replace your music application if you install it, um, but you still get both uh, icons, but they both lead to the same uh, the same app. <coughs> so the first thing as well, well the second thing even that you'll notice is um, the UI change here. Uh, at the top it has the different options, uh, the different ways you can search through your songs. So you've got artists, albums, songs, playlists, genres, um, and that's it. Also uh, it does have a rotation feature. Um, so you can view the apps, uh, you, view the apps. you can view the albums, uh, artists and such uh, through sort of an album or cover art view. Uh, it's just like the gallery app. Um, uses the accelerometer to tilt. Um, if you press the switch at the top, uh, now you get um, sort of a pile of uh, like a little pile of your um, albums and stuff. Um, I've not got any covers on, but I'm assuming that if I did, uh, it would show the covers instead. Um, you can from here you can just from here you can press in the top right um, to go to now playing like so just click the thing in the top right here um, if I switch it back round again um, and show you you can go to now playing from pressing the bottom at the uh, pressing the thing at the bottom there there's also some quite nice options with this. Uh, you can manage your music, library options, shuffle, search, or music settings. So I'm going to go to music settings here. Um, from these new options, I'm assuming that there's going to be some sort of streaming service set up, um, maybe through Gmail or uh, an external application. I'm not too sure about that yet, but that option seems to be blanked out, so I'm going to have to check that out uh, another time maybe when more information is released about it. Um, if I go to library settings as well uh, this will this basically filters your music so you can view all music streamed or kept. Um, if you look next to um, <coughs> some of the uh, options here uh, some of the songs here there's like a little options uh, menu. So if I tap that uh, next to one of the songs, you can play it, add it to playlist, use the ringtone, delete or search, which is quite helpful. Those are all new options. Also, you can see a little uh, equalizer uh, there or visualizer next to the music. Uh, so when you play it, just turn that down. Um, Here's the new Now Playing UI. You can go back to your songs or you can. Uh, oh, seems to be doing. Oh, this goes to the uh, playlist. There are the button in the top right and the top left goes back to your library, which is quite useful. Um, Um, normal buttons here. Uh, oh, I don't know what's going on here? Yeah, normal buttons here. Uh, play button there. Uh, previous track. Next track. Uh, the seeking options. Seeking bar here, so you can seek. Um, also, it's quite handy. Uh. You can see this. The artist of this song is Daft Punk. If I 
hold on the little marker next to it. You can search for Daft Punk using your browser, uh, your music application or YouTube. Uh, probably other apps as well that are installed um, that uh, will work with this that you can search for things for. You can also do the same with the Tron Legacy thing there. You can search for all the uh, all the details of your song uh, in YouTube or your browser or your music application. Um, so for this build really that's about it, that's as far as the features go. Uh, <coughs> you did kind of see um, sort of when you scroll down the background changes colour which is quite a cool little feature. Um, if I show you playing, now playing, that's what it looks like in uh, landscape mode and uh, yeah that's about it really. Uh, so if you've got any questions or whatever leave them in the comment section um, if you want to know more about it or you want to download it I'll leave a link in the description um, and I'll see you guys in the next video